Hey, what's up guys? Awesome back here. Another video. Um, got a bunch of new stuff here. Very thrilled. Uh, I'm going to save the unboxings for last. The big unboxings. I got everything in the package and stuff, so let's get into it. This here is a Saddlebrook and Dog Patch Trading Post unboxing. Well, unbagging. The first thing we got, we got some Kitek, uh, Easy Shiner 3.5 and Electric Bluegill. Um, I do have some music playing in the background, but <clears throat> hopefully I don't get in trouble over that. I actually got asked from one of my subscribers to play music in the background when I'm going task to task, so that's why I got it going. Uh, we got some Z-Man, Z-Man Copper Truce Turds, always love them. We got some Sungill Kitek Easy Shiner and 3 inch. Actually, I'm going to pause that for a second. And then we got, that is it from Dog Patch, bait wise. Now let's get into Saddlebrook. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, six packs of electric blue chartreuse and a three inch by Kitek. That there is my favorite color. Blue and chartreuse, basically. We got some lime. Booyah. We got two things of four pound cigar and Vizex. We got one thing of red label by cigar and 15 pound. We got one thing of 20 pound P line fluorocarbon, the tactical. And we got one thing of P line tactical and 12 pound. Then we got a few crankbaits. We got. A uh, spur rock crawler that goes 9 to 14 foot is in a half, I think, half ounce. And this color is called Green Crawl. We got two of these. They are in Molting Crawl Spurs. We got one Ozark Crawl Spur Rock Crawler. That is the last time you see that, that color. We got Spring Crawl. So, that is Crankbaits. And then we got four Alabama Rigs by Yum. Very cheap and expensive, $12. So now we are going to get into the rods. We got, <clears throat> we got us a new A-Rig rod. It is, I s said I would not throw this rod again, this brand rod again, but ended up, I didn't want to wait on shipping from Tackle Warehouse, so I just went ahead and picked it up. It is a Cashin. I actually have a broke Cashin over there. This here is a Cashin. And is a 7 fast heavy. So this is going to be my new A-Rig rod. I can throw a half to two ounce bait on here. Very ideal for an A-Rig. One thing I do like about it. Well, if I never get the plastic off of everything on it. You know what? Forget about it now. We have to have some fun in the video. I 
I say this would be a good time to turn on the music. There we go. <clears throat> it does have a nice core candle though. I do like that. But that is a 7-Eleven heavy caching rod. Golly. <laughs> you can tell it's a 7-Eleven. It's hard. And then we got my favorite rod of all times. A Shimano Zodius. This is a new one. It does have the big butt in on it. I'm not sure how I like that. But I went ahead and picked one up. It is in a 7 foot 2. Well. It is in a 7 foot 2. And i throw a 3 eighths to a half. So I'm going to guess it's a medium heavy. Yep. Medium heavy. So, that there would be my new swim bait rod. And then my 13 fishing rod over there, it's going to be my new jig rod. Now, here is the beans and the potatoes. I ran across some deals today. This here don't need no introduction. <clears throat> it's a Shimano Stratic. Not sure if it, not sure the year or anything. Not even sure if it was worth what I gave for it, but a Stratic for a hundred dollars, I'm not going to pass it up. So we picked that up. The guy put it in the box for me. He was so kind. It shows I'm not used to the, these because I just remembered I ain't even got to take that cap off. To put it on the same hand, I just have to wheel it up on there. Right there it is. So. Chris. <clears throat> we got that Stratic there. We got, no, can I show you that yet? No, 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 no. We got another Tatula SV. I love my SV so much I had to pick up another one. It's in an 8 to 1 to 1 gear ratio. I'm going to spool this up with some... Probably going to spool it up with some... Let's see here. Tactical 12 pound. If I even bought any. I can't remember. Yeah, 12 pound. So this will be a jig grill. And then we got, I told you I was going on to Taylor, but for what I gave for this, I can't pass it up. 350 bucks. A light new Shimano Metanium. It is a 6-2 to 1 though. I would like it to be an 8 or a 7, but I would like it to be faster. That's the only thing I can ask for. But this here uh, keep me from reeling my swim baits too fast. But the only downside is if a smallmouth runs to the boat at me, I lose him. Because I normally reel so fast. Where with this, I'm... Let's see here, the Tatula and the 8, well, I got the wrong box. It a, says a 7 to 1. It cranks up 28 inches per turn. And then a titanium cranks up. What does it crank up here? I'm not even sure where to find it. Here it is. Twenty six. So basically a uh, 6 two to 1 and a Shimano is a 7 1 to 1 and a Tatula and a SV. So definitely excited to try all this good stuff out. Um, go, go by Monday. Well, I don't work Monday. Tuesday, I meant. And check on water pump. So, yeah. Fun. 
That way I can get out on the water. Because they're getting ready to be hitting. Me and Josh had a ball out there on Laurel catching them. Although they was mostly dinks, we still had fun. But <clears throat> I'm going to get into some of the specs on the line, why I picked it and stuff. The four pound is going to be my finesse stuff. So Ned rigs and small swim baits and Domenke rigs and maybe a drop shot. The 15 pound red label that there's going to be my cranking line. Cranking it makes it crinkle up and do all kind of funny crap. So that's why I went cheap with that type fluorocarbon. The 12 pound P line tactical is going to be my jig line. The 20 pound P line tactical is going to be my A rig line. So. That's that, folks. That's how you blow through right at mm, roughly a grand. A little over $1,000. But nonetheless, thank y'all for watching this. Y'all be sure to check out Dog Patch. Oh, I forgot. New merch available at Dog Patch. I love these hats. Like, they. That's a rugged look, like, it looks like it's dirty, but that's how it's made black and white, like, mwah. So, be sure to check out Dog Patch, get you some new merch. Make sure to check out Saddlebrook Outdoors, The Tackle Spot, and Kurt Singer Sunrise Outfitters. And as always, be sure to give God all the glory, be sure to have fun, be safe, and y'all have a good day. I'm out.